The Worldwide Day of Play helps get kids away from in front of the television and involved in other fun activities. Haiti Clotter shows us how a day of play can be a good thing for kids. Paul Bunyan Park in Bemidji turned into a large playground for the annual Worldwide Day of Play. The day to celebrate um, screen-free play, so we're trying to get kids outdoors away from the TV. Through collaboration with other organizations, the campaign helps get kids outside. The event has been a staple in Bemidji since 2009 and every year has gotten bigger and better. Bounce houses, we've got free samples of Jimmy John sandwiches today. We've got an awesome DJ, so there's lots of music and a couple new vendors. Yep. Tell me, what's been your favorite thing to do? Uh, going on the bouncy house one time. The day was full of fun for kids of all ages. They played games, blew bubbles, and lined up for the giant inflatable Iron Man. One of the most popular obstacles was the Iron Man challenge. I had to try it for myself. Mark and Henry Haugen were in town visiting family and decided to come out and have some fun. When we left, he was playing on his iPad at home at Grandma's, and to get him out of the house is a lot better than just sitting in front of a TV screen or in front of the iPad. So much better. Get him outside, playing, interacting with other kids. Rewards weren't just handed out, kids had to earn them. Here kids make a smoothie, but in order for the blender to work, they have to use their energy on the bike blender. You don't have to go walk miles, you can get on a bike and it's, you're still like having fun and getting exercise and you're not staring at a screen. Last year about 250 people showed up and it looks like this year was another success. <laughs> I think he's having a good time. In Bemidji, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. Different vendors were also on site to let parents know about their services. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.